red lily beetles. As soon as you notice holes in your leaves, you know that they've been around eating them. So that's the first generation. They fly in, eat some of your plants, eat holes in your plants, and then lay eggs. And I'll show you what the eggs look like. They are like that. So crush those guys, three of them. Three eggs, they must be three egg packs. A bunch of eggs inside there, or uh, I guess they're three individual eggs. Anyways, so crush those guys, or you'll have another generation of those guys. Oh, there they are. There's the little culprits. Thing is, they, uh, People probably mistake them for uh, for uh, that's a dead guy, I think. One got away. People probably mistake them for uh, ladybugs. They don't kill them, so I think they've adapted to look like ladybugs, so they're safe. So you just squash them. And there's another guy. This lasts all season, getting these guys. There's oils you can put on, spray on your plants, diluted with water. I forget what the oil is called, I'll look it up. Take that. So again, as soon as you notice holes in your leaves, that's what that's from. Those guys eating them. So unfortunately, uh, lilies are nice and pretty much maintenance free all season but they can eat your plant down to nothing if you don't keep on it and as soon as they hear you coming here's two of them mating as soon as they hear you coming they they drop to the ground and if they're upside down you can't see them because they're black bottom Take that. But fortunately they're red on the top, so they can so you can spot them against the green leaves, but unfortunately they look too much like ladybugs and the untrained eye can think that that's what they are. Young ladybugs or some crap like that. Okay, I got this at the health food store. I don't know what else it's used for, but I heard that um, it's commonly used for diluting. I don't know, a few drops, I can't remember. You have to read the label or look it up, but. Uh, dilute it with water and spray your plants. And I don't know, it's, it's not toxic to them, but somehow it sticks to them or something. Uh, deters them or something. There, look at these little bastards. So to grab them, you've got to be pretty quick because they'll just drop as soon as they sense a shadow. There's one on the underside of that leaf that will drop as soon as he senses me, little bastards. They are mating. So, Unfortunately, you'll spend a lot of your time squashing these guys and finding them on your plants on your lilies and the larva look like a blotch about that size well they look like a blotch about the size of an adult but they're all black and they're on the underside of the leaves so if you don't get the eggs in time You'll have these sticky black blotches under the leaves, and you're gonna squash them too. They're kind of messy. Well, I guess no messier than squashing those guys, but this guy's still alive, but incapacitated.